The T-drill is one of the simplest yet most effective drills you can do to improve your swing mechanics. Doing this drill with a swift stick will allow you to get hundreds more swings than you could get with a regular game bat, helping you burn in your muscle memory. This drill will also train your eyes to bring the point of focus closer to the point of contact. We recommend using a soft rubber tee. Using a hard rubber tee will damage the foam head. It's important to remember that when setting up the tee, the ball should be positioned slightly in front of your batting stance. This drill can be performed with or without a parent or coach and will help you build good swing mechanics. Good. The soft toss drill helps develop the balance, rhythm, and timing of a proper swing. Swift Stick's lightweight helps the hitter use the correct hand action to move the bat quickly through the hitting zone, rather than forcing the bat into the zone with the body. The hitter takes a normal batting stance, the ball tosser stands about 5 to 7 feet away and in about a 45 degree angle from the front of the hitter. Remember to use a tennis ball, poly ball, or a soft foam ball. The tosser starts the drill by showing the ball, then slowly underhand swinging the ball away from the hitter. The hitter initiates load and stride with this motion. When the tosser underhand tosses the ball into the hitting zone, the hitter transfers weight and uses a short and quick swing to contact the ball. The pitching machine drill simulates the hitting of a pitched ball while emphasizing proper swing mechanics and improving hand-eye coordination. Swift Stick's concave foam head gives the hitter instant feedback on contact with the ball. Since this drill does not require a second person, it is ideal for self-instruction or extra practice. It is also ideal for a coach or instructor to observe the swing mechanics of the hitter. Set the self-loading pitching machine about 30 feet from home plate. Since there is no arm reference, the hitter should swing from the ready position to avoid hurrying the swing, which can lead to bad swing mechanics. The hitter focuses on waiting for the ball to enter the hitting zone and then attempts to make contact with the sweet spot. With consistent contact on the sweet spot, the hitter will develop confidence, learn to be patient at the plate, and use the entire field. This drill gives muscle memory a chance to burn in, improves hand-eye coordination, and helps isolate the sweet spot. The team drill is great for working with multiple hitters at one time. If you have limited batting practice time or are looking to add some excitement to practice, try this drill. The swift stick allows each hitter to take up to 100 swings each in under 15 minutes. For this drill, we recommend poly balls, not tennis balls. The tosser should wear protective eyewear or pull the bill of his baseball cap tightly down to the eyes. The tosser kneels or stands with five to six hitters forming a circle around him. Each hitter should take their batting stance about 15 to 20 feet from the tosser, leaving a safe distance between hitters. The tosser shows the ball and then tosses two to three consecutive balls about waist high to the hitter. He then turns and tosses to the next hitter, continuing around the circle. You've just seen a few ways the swift stick can be used more effectively than a game bat. And of course, more reps will get you there faster. So keep practicing, have fun, good luck, continued success, and get a good pitch to hit.